Hey guys, Rod Sanger of Cardiff Security. Welcome back to the channel. We are here at Goodwood Festival of Speed and look where I am, Gunther Work Stand. And we have two gorgeous 993s here and we've got Amjad, the technical director, and he's gonna talk about these two amazing machines, including the new turbo. So guys, sit back and hopefully you'll enjoy this episode. So guys, yes, Gunther works, and we have Amjad, technical director. Good to see you, Raj. Yeah, good to see you too. He has been on the channel before. Last year at the Flat Six event, they had the 993 normally aspirated there on show. The green, what was it? Cedar green car. Okay, Cedar yeah. green car. And what a car. If you've not seen that episode, in the description below, you can watch that. And today, they've upped their game. They're not messing about. They've bought two Gunther works here, naturally aspirated and, and turbo. turbo power. Shall we start with the naturally aspirated yeah. first? The Cedar Green car that you saw last yeah. year, that was a client's car that wasn't for the UK. It's a customer that keeps a car That was left-hand drive, left well. drive as well. Left-hand drive as well, yeah. So this car is our first UK car, but this is a really special car. So this is a one of one. And this is called Bubblegum Edition. Bubblegum um, Edition? Yeah. Is well, that the official name you're giving? It's, it's the Bubblegum Edition. Okay, Actually, guys. You know, um, and it's made for a client who who's already has a turbo in order and he wanted something really unique. So this is a one of one. So there's a number of differences to this car. It has double bubble roof, which is off our turbo. It has a different front bumper, which is very similar to the Speedster front bumper. And it has the larger rear wing. And then he picked the color. It took a lot of tryouts. But we As I can imagine. We eventually got the color that he wanted. And um, he came and saw it today for the first time. Was he blown away? He loves it. And to be fair, we all didn't think we'd love it, but we ended up loving it. And the reaction today has just been phenomenal. Every single person that's been on the booth, they've made a beeline to the car. So remind our audience, what's the specs on this car? So this is a naturally aspirated car. It's got a four litre flat six with 435 horsepower. Car weighs just under 1200 kilograms, similar to Cedar. So it is a 993 underneath yeah. there. So, so this is a 993 shell that we completely um, restore and then we modify it. So it has carbon fiber, front bonnet, front bumper, front wings, rear quarters, roof, rear tailgate, and the rear bumper. It has our own carbon fiber seats, has carbon fiber rear seat delete. So there's a lot of carbon fiber parts. Oh, it has our own headlamps, it has our own tail lights. Wheels. Oh, and it has a forged magnesium and carbon fiber wheels, two piece wheels, so, which I really, really, really like. So hence why the car only weighs 1190 kilograms. So 1190 kilograms, five, four, no, 435 horsepower. 435, naturally aspirated. Naturally aspirated, eight, revved yeah. up to seven, eight, uh, fully lightweight inside, stripped out, two seats, no rear seats, just That's uh, right, can't fire have a rear seat yeah. But yeah, it just looks stunning. And the color is, especially in the sun, Yes. it's got so much um, sparkle through it. It just, it is stunning. Um, and every single person here that came today just loved it. Well, I'm blown away by it. This is a one of one. This is different to the Cedar Commission. We say one of one, so if a customer comes and says, I want to commission this same design, maybe in a different color, you can do the same front end, you can do the same rear wing. But not in this color, but it's commissioned specifically for this customer. For the, for the client. Yeah, we'll never and make another one in this roughly color. roughly what kind of money, monetary value are we a talking? A lot. We're talking a million US? Give or take? Yeah, I think you've been a bit conservative there. So. Okay, guys, so he's not going to reveal that because obviously it's a client's car and, you know, maybe he doesn't want everyone to know. And so now that's the naturally aspirated 993 Gunther Works. And then we move on to something that you mentioned to me last year. I did, yes. And now we see it here in real life. this car last August, Monterey Car Week. Since then, cars evolved a hell of a lot. Our target for this car 
was 700 horsepower. Okay. The engine in this car produces 793 horsepower. Okay. The production car is going to be switchable between 550, 650, and 750 horsepower. Right. From a dial. So, uh, and again, this is a lot different to um, our other coupe and, and speedsters. So we have a front bonnet vent, which has the um, yeah, radiator that's, for our uh, charge that's, cooler that's system. Just, just amazing. A lot more aggressive front bumper. So obviously that means that, as we spoke earlier, there's no frunk as such. No. There'll be no space no. for anything no. in the front. The front wings are vented here at the sides. All the turbulent air that gets trapped in the front wheel wells. Okay. That's to let that exit. And then the side vents are fully uh, functional. So they channel air in so we have an intake system that runs over the rear wheels and then through a filter and then straight into our turbo so we've got a turbo at each corner so in terms of width is the car slightly wider than no the, the width is this believe it or not the width is the same because the way we built the chassis for these cars was all from a handling perspective so there's a lot of grip on these cars mm. and the reason we did that at the time people were like okay well now here's the answer so the reason the cars have got a lot of mechanical grip and handle so well is they were actually designed to take 700 plus horsepower. Carbon ceramics? Carbon ceramics on both cars actually, yeah. So the wheels are interesting. So these wheels we've developed, these are sided wheels. Okay. If you look at the design on the outside, so these are designed, they create a vortex, which then basically draws air out from the brakes. Um, Clever design. Brakes, yeah, it keeps the brakes cool. So those are new for this car. So it's twin turbocharged, twin charge cooled, and on individual throttle body. So it's not like, it comes with a single uh, intake manifold with a single throttle body. This is all on individual throttle bodies and flat fan. So flat fan, the reason we, people ask us, oh, did you do this? Because, you know, historically Porsche did it. Yeah, we did because it works. On a vertical fan, cylinders one and four, which are at the back, always run slightly hotter yes, than the four front cylinders. What the flat fan allows us to do is it allows us to run all six cylinders at the same temperature, so it cools them equally. And that's why we did it, because obviously we've got 750 plus horsepower coming out of a four litre flat six, and that necessitated the flat fan. So this is why we, we launched, when we launched this it, last it, year, it is just, that was a question mm. we got asked a lot. And then we, what we did from last year, from when we first showed the car, is we've completely redesigned the charge coolers. So now the charge coolers are curved, so we did a lot of CFD testing, and we optimize them for airflow, and they work way more efficiently than they used to work before. And I'll give an example. Intake temperatures in Fahrenheit, this was at 60 degree uh, Fahrenheit ambient. 198 degrees Fahrenheit at the top of the charge cooler. Wow. And 88 degrees at the bottom, and it's only two and a half inches thick. So amazing. it made them way more efficient, which pushed the power up. So now, like I said, this engine, it will be 750 in production form, but this particular engine is producing 793 horsepower at the moment. And interior wise, it's more or less the same as the naturally aspirated? Well, a little bit different. So we have a carbon center console, which has been newly developed for the car with a phone holder in the front. Um, we have uh, the nose lift system and the sport settings are on now okay. on the steering wheel. We've got a boost gauge on the on top of the dashboard, our own carbon seats. So this is our new style of carbon seat, which if you notice is vented. Oh yes. And it has See individual that. pads. And what we do is we tailor those pads for each particular customer. For the so, client. Yeah, so to, to make them fit. Uh, and they're lighter again than our uh, original seats. So these have all been developed specifically for uh, for our turbo. So when is production of Q, Q4 this year? Okay. Q4. So in terms of money, if that's a million, uh, and I'm being conservative, a million. Well, we're US. at Goodwood, right? We're Rolls Royce, yeah. yeah so, so you know what they say: if you need to ask. Well, I have to ask. You know. Um, so you guys can guess. You know. Yeah. That's a a million and I'm being conservative. And we're building 75 yeah. of these and most of them I've spoken for. So which number is mine? Um, oh, we're still working in the application, aren't we? We're still, yeah. we're still, we're still having a chat. I've got to speak we, to... We were going to do the 12 to 1 spot, weren't we? Yeah, I've got to yeah. speak to Lombard Finance yeah. first. Okay. See if Let's I can get some finance yeah, yeah, approved. Cool. We'll look after you, lad. You know, we always do. <laughs> uh, um, so guys, this guy knows his beans and he can carry on talking. This would be one long ass episode if I don't stop it now. So we're going to... We're gonna cap it now. Appreciate you coming over. Mate. This is the first time appreciate out, uh, exhibiting outside of America, and so I appreciate you coming over and spending the time with us. You yeah. know, I've got a lot of passion for Porsche, but I've got a lot of passion for the Gunther brand. Um, appreciate that. You know, if 
my lottery numbers come through. If I sell a few more cast areas between now and Q4. Lottery numbers, mate. You don't need lottery numbers to buy one of these. <laughs> but look, Amjad, appreciate you taking Thank out you. the time because I know you've been busy. Thank you uh, for coming over. No. It's very much appreciated. So guys, naturally aspirated or turbo powered? Which one would you go for if your lottery numbers come through tonight? I know which one I'd go for. Guys, thanks for watching. Thank Drop a comment below. Uh, Gunther Works details on the screen and in the description below. Make sure you give them a follow. These are just two amazing 993s. I'm in love with both of them. Um, so guys, drop a comment. But you know what to do. Share, subscribe to the channel. A lot more content coming your way. Thanks to Amjad, and I'll see you again soon on Cast TV.